I'm Jenny Hines in York. I'm the editor in chief of Home Access Today magazine. We're here again at the Las Vegas market. I've got Dorothy Melshaw today, the president of Gift and Home Decor for International Market Centers. Dorothy, there's a lot going on this week, but let's talk a little bit about C5 in particular. Absolutely. Um, so C5 is uh, the last of the new floor launches within the home decor category. We've done several others over the last three years. Um, and we soft launched C5 six months ago during the winter market with a partial uh, launch of new showrooms, uh, Gold Leaf being one of them. But this market, we were able to more than double not only the square footage, uh, but the number of resources on the floor. And some of the key new tenants on the floor for this market are Bobo Intriguing Objects. We're incredibly excited to have Mark Sage and his magical team here. Um, and then Motodora Bianchi Group, which is a rep group out of California that brought in more than 16 leading home decor and decorative accessory lines. We also have a really exciting expansion by Collective Home, which features both home decor, decorative accessories, and some gift items as well, as well as a number of different individual corporate showrooms throughout the floors. Probably one of the, the more innovative of the floors that we have today in terms of number of resources and people doing really new and different things. A really great mix, a really exciting mix, a lot of different types of resources, and just a, a real discovery, I think, for people that, that come to the floor for this market. Thanks, it looks great. Absolutely. Mark Sage is the owner of Bobo Intriguing Objects, a new exhibitor here on C5 floor in Las Vegas. Mark, tell us what brings you here. Well, for many years we did uh, shows on the East Coast. We did uh, New York and High Point and Atlanta. And, you know, just like every company, we put a push pin as to where our active counts are. And we're typically a, an East Coast company. And uh, I thought it was time for us to get West Coast representation. And we uh, chose Vegas, and this is our first show. We've got a great location right here on the escalators we in do. C5, so tell us a little bit about the space. 6,500 square feet, and um, yeah, I wanted something with a lot of visibility, a lot of space, you know, a raw space that we could work with, and, and this was available, and I like to be, you know, right off the escalators where people can't miss me, and so um, when this came available, it was the one I wanted. Do you have any thoughts about the evolution of the higher end here in Las Vegas? I think that some, a lot more of that's happening. I mean, I think... You know, he wooed me for about four years to try to come here and do this show. And, and four years ago, I really didn't think that the, the vendor base was that great as far as high end. Um, and more and more, my peers started to come. And, and so now I think what you'll find here is, you know, not your tchotchke low end market. There's a lot of higher end vendors and we're you know, in that group for sure. Um, and, uh, you know, with, with more and more high end vendors, come a more discerning buyer. And, and uh, so I think both of those have come to Vegas, certainly within the last year. Well, thank you, Mark. Hope you have a great market. Sure, thank you. Appreciate it.